Welcome to today's day, DRS. Today we want to decree liberty. We want to enforce our freedom. Obadiah 117 says, But on Mount Zion there shall be deliverance, and there shall be holiness. The house of Jacob shall possess their possession. So we want freedom from bad habits, freedom from generational cause. We want to break hindering spirit, freedom from every form of captivity. There was a time Peter was in prison. In Acts 12, the Bible talks uh, from verses 1. Now about that time, Herod the king stretched out his hand to harass some from the church. Then he killed James, the brother of John, with the sword. And because he saw that it pleased the Jews, he proceeded further to seize Peter also. Now it was during the days of unleaving bread. So when he had arrested him, he put him in prison and delivered him to four squares of soldiers to keep him, intending to bring him before the people after Passover. Verse 5, Peter was therefore kept in prison, but constant prayer was offered to God for him by the church. You know what? The angel of the Lord visited Peter and delivered him. In fact, doors were just opening out of their own accord. Peter was led out of the prison. Peter was led road by road, street by street, up to the house where the believers were preaching. What a miracle. So I want us to decree, I want you to say, I decree liberty from load and oppression, wickedness and the cruelty and the captivity of Satan. I decree liberty from the sword of error. I decree liberty from pains. I decree liberty from affliction. I decree liberty from sickness. I decree liberty from entrapment, from encroachment, from every form of entanglement in the name of Jesus. Thank you.